Yo, what's good guys? This is Nightwing2303 from Wertesters.com. Got a brand new pickup in today, a pair of boosts. Adidas was having a 30% off sale, so I scooped up a new pair. Been really dying to grab a new pair because my old pair is pretty trash. But I didn't want to pay retail, so once they had that sale, I knew it was time to scoop up a new fresh pair. But before we get into these, go pick up the new Kicks magazine. This is one of my favorite magazines of all time, especially when I was in high school. It was the only thing back then that was literally dedicated to sneakers besides East Bay. This is before like the whole internet blog era. There was internet but there wasn't really blogs there was forums and chat rooms but the reason why you guys should pick this up is because they did an article on brand black and specifically the J crossover 3 and inside them actually featured my name is in there my real name and my YouTube name how dope is that so again if you guys want to pick these up they're on newsstands now now these guys are the pure boost chill as for the shoe itself um, it smells really funny I don't know what it is it's like a weird kind of glue that they used and there's this little card that it comes with as well talking about how it's a um, it's it's responsible innovation which reduced carbon dioxide emissions reduced water use and energy use it's a luxury microfiber from something clarino that is made without any solvents during the manufacturing process so I think that's the smell that I'm smelling it's just a weird different smell I guess one can say that that's just a new memory added to the vault as for getting up close here you go it's a super open aired mesh really nice really well ventilated super comfortable on foot only downside is that these actually run a half a size big man and nobody said nothing on the Adidas website in the review section so I'm a little bit pissed that so they're a little bit more loose than I'd personally like but I'm gonna keep them anyways because I hate dealing with returning stuff online I think it's a big hassle uh, the boost in these guys is super fluffy man I don't know if it's because I worn my other pair to the point of no return but when I put one on each foot you could definitely tell that these ones were just a little bit more comfortable and you got this synthetic suede on the tongue here no insole or anything like that just like the originals this does not make you feel the boost any better than having an insole in there for those of you wondering I know that I've gotten that question a few times on like the D Rose stuff and the I think it was like the crazy light boost or whatever and that's not true trust me you're gonna to feel this shit no matter what so putting an insole on top of that's not going to do a damn thing as far as canceling out the feeling that boost brings boost is that awesome now my favorite part with this guy here is the whole molded collar right here uh the the heel area kind of reminds me of robin uh, the boy wonder but i just like how it is it's not going to jab into your foot and all that stuff like the original did so this and the tongue area just a lot softer more plush and I just think that it feels a lot nicer when it's on your foot. And that pretty much takes care of it. I think these shoes are awesome. I've said this since the beginning, ever since I first tried Boost. If you try it on, you're gonna leave with a pair because they're that awesome, trust me. Best cushion ever. So thank you guys for watching. Thanks for all your support and until next time guys, have a good one.